Hello, hello, my lovely Cappies. Welcome to Vivid Vibration. My name is Christina. Y'all got the Queen, the Eternal Child, the Pilgrim, the Prayer, Kairos, and Olivia. Cappy. <laughs> um, I feel like there's just kind of this idea of like watching and uncovering the truth. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like this, I mean, Kairos is a creeper card. Um, how it comes through for me a lot of times, it is also the idea of patiently sitting back and waiting um, and just kind of letting the, like the truth will expose itself ultimately, right? I mean, it's just kind of like people can live in these whirlwind realities, but the dust always settles and the truth always reveals itself, you know? <laughs> and I feel like there's just this feeling of like the dust settling and the truth revealing itself and you bearing witness to it. I feel like part of this is, I mean, with the queen and the eternal child and Cappy's, I want to say you can be on either side of the story. These are general reads. Take what resonates and leave the rest. Okay. Um, <laughs> please like, share, and subscribe. <laughs> um, but the queen is the idea that I like it turns the king's head in the neck it, that it's the neck that turns the head in the direction that it needs to go. The queen is influential. The queen has an understanding of all the things that are going on around her. And she's, she's, I mean, the moon and the, the queen, she represents a, like a high level of empathy and awareness, right? And that's how she's able to direct the attention and it, like direct the attention to where it needs to be because she's aware of everything outside of herself. And I feel like part of the truth that's been revealed is through an awareness that is coming from, um, you know, like something outside of yourself. Uh, you know, this, this can be a, a female or a male, you know, obviously gender neutral, um, you know, everybody has masculine and feminine energy. So, you know, take it how it resonates. But it's just this idea of like having somebody really just say like, would you just like stop for five seconds and look this way, please? You know what I mean? <laughs> Maybe with less sass, but I don't know. I I kind of feel like you've had this idea of like a, a stubborn energy, right? And and I almost feel like that stubborn energy is is gone. And there's this like this change to a level of curiosity and and almost this like innocence as this like childlike curiosity, because it's like when, once you turn your, your vision elsewhere, I think that things look very different. And, uh, you know, the pilgrim is this idea of like a, a journey within and the prayer is the idea of manifestation. And I almost, and again, you know, copies, it is this idea that has been present in your reads for a while of just this, like, when things finally click, when things finally make sense to you, and it's just kind of like, it, it, I almost want to say, like, it just, like, it hits you deep, and it affects you internally in a way that really sends you um, on this idea of, like, what is it that I, I, I almost want to say just, like, an exploration of, like, what is it that I've really wanted? What is it that I, what is it that I wanted in relationships? What is it that I've wanted in life? And how is it that I have, you know, brought those things into existence? Because Cappies, y'all are the, the fucking goats, right? You are out here killing it and, and, you know, like building your, building your businesses, building your dreams, building your life, um, you know, like doing whatever it is that you need to do to like, I think, satisfy your, your needs. And I almost kind of get the feeling of like this, like you fell short, like you, like, like you were short-sighted for yourself. Like you weren't even really, like you were so focused on, you know, like one mentality that you were missing out on the entirety of it all. But I feel like once you look in a different direction, you are reawakened to yourself and the truth of yourself and the truth of what you, what you want out of life. In, in like a bigger picture. Um, okay, Cappy. What else can we get for y'all? 
a little jingle today, apparently. <laughs> the Five of Swords, no. <laughs> the King of Cups. Nine of Swords, Ten of Swords. A lot of, yeah, a lot of illumination, a lot of awareness that's happening here for y'all. <laughs> um, <clears throat> okay, let's see here. Da -da -da -da. Hmm. Okay, so the, I want to say the Nine of Swords and the Ten of Swords and the Five of Swords. There's this idea of like having an awareness of like what, what was causing all of this tension? Like where was this tension coming from? You know, like why did it occur? How did it occur? I feel like there's one of your reads recently where it was just like, how did it go through such, such extremes? you know, like these low lows. And I feel like part of this like awareness and this illumination of these low lows is this idea of control, manipulation, tit for tat, um, you know, like, and, and not really seeing things for what they are, um, you know, just seeing how you can, or, and you can be on either side of the story, just seeing how you can manipulate the confusion of someone. I almost feel like there was this idea of like somebody being really like need like floundering. I get this image of somebody who's floundering and it's like rather than rather than give them a hand and or throw them a rope or whatever, you just attacked them and mocked them and told them, ha, ha look at you flounder, you failure. Don't you wish you had money like me? Don't you wish you had connections like me? Don't you wish that you had this like me? Sucks to be you. That's spiteful. That's some spiteful energy, Kathy. And I don't know if that's coming from you or the other person, taking how it resonates, but it's not anything that I would want to be fucking with. So I feel like the idea here, obviously, is this person did not want to fuck with it. <laughs> You know what I mean? Like there's this real idea of like going on their way. And it's like, you know what? I might not be where you're at financially. And I might not be where you're at in terms of connections. Like, sorry, my daddy doesn't, you know, like it wasn't in politics. You know what I mean? Like doesn't run the town. You know, sorry, my family doesn't, you know, like own stock in this. Like, sorry that I'm not like fucking neck deep in the, in the connections that you have. But, you know, like, that doesn't negate my value and you can mock me and you can belittle me and you can kick me when I'm down and laugh at me while I drown. But, you know, like, that's fine. I'll, I'll go on my way. Again, it's this idea of like having an illumination. I think of just some really bad behavior. And then you have the two of, of cups, the king of cups and the queen of cups. And it's just this idea of like really loving someone and, 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 being in this like divine partnership, obviously gender neutral, take it how it resonates, but um, I almost feel like it's just this, this, like you see what you, what could have been if you would have been protective. If you would have protected me, this is what you would have had. The Santa Muerta. Um, <clears throat> and I guess, and the feeling, this, the, the idea here is that, you know, like bring it, bringing it back to life, you know, I like, can I, can I resuscitate this? Um, okay. More cards for Kathy. <laughs> okay. How much can we get for Kathy? Justice. Yeah. Can I bring justice to this situation? Because I feel like, obviously, if it requires justice, then there was a high level of injustice. <laughs> you know, and I feel like there's this idea of like, can I bring justice back to this? Can I, can I bring this back into balance? Can balance be restored?
can I decide love? Ten times. Make a wish. <laughs> um, okay, let's do one more card for my copies and we'll call it a read. The offering and the hunter. <laughs> Um, I, 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 again, I just, Cappies, I feel like there's just this idea of recognizing things for what they are. Um, I think seeing how destructive someone is or how destructive you are or were, and I think wanting to make right a wrong. I think wanting to create justice, to bring balance, to renew something that I think you see <clears throat> very differently than you once did. Um, all right, Cappy. Well, I send you all my love. Um, thank you so much for hanging out with me. If Oh, I am doing personal reads now. They are 45 minutes long. This gives us an opportunity to answer any questions you have concerning any past, present, or future energies. Um, if this is where we part ways, thank you so much for hanging out with me. Please do give me a like, share, and subscribe as I am just getting started. And yeah, I hope y'all are doing well and see you again soon. Bye.